Hi, everybody. My name is Nicholas Kress, and I'm the Outreach and Engagement Coordinator for Housing and Residence Life. And I'd like to welcome you all today to uh, take a look at our newly renovated Stevenson Third, uh, which also matches the Stevenson Second Floor uh, rooms. Uh, and we've uh, got a great tour that, that you'll get to see what the room looks like today. Um, a couple of things I want you all to know about before we go ahead and get started is on February 9th is when room renewal opens. So if you want to get the Stevenson third floor room uh, all to yourself, uh, you'll want to make sure to jump on that on February 9th. Uh, your $200 deposit does roll over. So if you are currently staying with us in the residence halls, you can use your $200 deposit uh, to pay that deposit right now and, and go ahead and get uh, all, all registered and, and signed up for your room for the 2021 to 2022 academic year. Uh, if you want to uh, get signed up and you know that uh, which room you want to choose, uh, you'll want to go to iwanthousing.uidaho.edu. And if you are just wanting to kind of look around what some of your options are, look at some more photos, uh, you can go to uidaho.edu slash housing. And now I'm going to go ahead and turn it over to Shalom, who's going to go ahead and give us a tour. Hey everyone, I'm Shalom. I am a student at the University of Idaho studying mechanical engineering. Today I'm going to show you a typical Stevenson single room. Okay, the first thing that I'm going to point out is the sink. And there will be a nice mirror that's going to go right behind that sink. They are, are currently on order. Your clothes. In this room, you also find a bed, a nice single bed, twin bed with storage. There are also power outlets close to your bed. So if you want to charge your phone, I charge my phone in the evening. So that's good. Next to the building is the parking lot. So if you have a car, you can park your car there and then just like walk to your room, which is convenient, especially on rainy days. There's also a table and a chair. If you want to study, you can put your books, papers, stationery. And with this room for privacy, there's a sliding bundle so if you want to have some privacy, you can just close it. That's a nice feature that I like. That's unique. And then there's a bathroom that comes with the room. So you have the toilet and you also have the shower. And there's the other side of the room where you have one other roommate. Well, on the other side, you still have that sliding door where you can have that privacy. There's a desk and a chair. You also have the bed and you get to see the greenhouse that the College of Agriculture and Life Sciences run. We see the sink, and again, like what I said earlier on, there will be a mirror right here, a big one. Story space, power outlet if you want to shave or blow dry your hair storage space at the bottom. A trash can that comes with the room, 
And lastly, another closet for the other roommate. So this wraps up a typical Stevenson single room. Thank you for joining us. Awesome. awesome. Thank you, Shalom. Well, uh, as you all saw, that's uh, our typical room in Stevenson Wing. Uh, third floor uh, is newly renovated. So if you want to be one of the first to, uh, to stay in the room, it's uh, all redesigned. Uh, be sure to, uh, to sign up on February 9th so you don't miss your chance. Uh, also, Stevenson Second also looks uh, uh, just like these rooms, and they have a very similar layout and design. Uh, so February 9th is the date you want to do that at. Also, uh, be sure to join us uh, on February 11th outside of the hub at 1130 for our next student appreciation event where we'll be giving out these awesome stickers. Uh, and that's the next sticker in our series and it is limited. So be sure to get yours today. Thank you so much and have a great day.